Mike Elko is very good friends with Clark Lee, and we didn't move the ball at all the second half, so we better study the second half of the Notre Dame defensive game because that's what we're going to see uh, because Mike Elko is a really good coach. Um, so uh, I think that's the biggest thing is, is – uh, they were more physical than we were with their front seven and our front seven the second half. Um, now we've got to figure out who we are because we're going to have a different personality than, than we did with those three players that we've lost. Um, but we've got to be physical at the line of scrimmage to have a chance in this game because A&M, like Notre Dame, is huge and they're very physical. Uh, both teams try to keep the ball. They totally dominate time of possession. Uh, and then they pound you and pound you with a big back and then use play action. And Kellen Mond is very much like Ian Book. He's a game manager. He's been around a long time. He's not going to make mistakes. He's going to get the ball to the right players. Uh, like Notre Dame, um, A&M has a great tight end. So it, it's just been funny to look and see how much those teams look like bookends uh, when we're studying them. You can understand defensively because the Clark Lee and – and uh, Mike were our buddies and they're on the same page. Uh, but offensively, uh, they're very, very similar. They're, they're both built like big pro football teams. You know, they're really good offense. They're like they're, they're the offense you would think a, a top, you know, two or three team in our country would have. They're, they're number two in the country on third downs. I think Kellen Mond is a terrific football player. Um, really, really smart, doesn't get fooled. Um, you know, really impressed with him. I think the offensive line is, is one of the best, if not the best offensive lines that we've played since we've been here. Um, and then I think the two running backs, you know, 28s are tremendous players, all SEC as a sophomore. Um, you, you can look back at, you know, I, I pulled this up for the DBs um, last week when they announced the all SEC and, I, and it was like the last 10 years of all SEC tailbacks and they're, they're pretty well-known, well-known guys. Right. So, um, and then the kid who, I, I think is, is a tremendous football player is number zero. He plays running back. He plays slot receiver. He plays outside receiver. Um, and he, he is a tremendous football player. So we, we got a real challenge on our hands. Um, obviously we're going to have to do a really good job up front and that's where it all starts. And, and from there we'll have to cover them and, and you know, they're going to, they're going to force you to, to, to make competitive throws and, and play competitive coverage. And that's going to be the, the key in the game, I think.